What's up YouTube? It's been a while. I'm coming at you from the entrance way, heading out through here to where the new shop is going to be. <clears throat> and yeah, you heard right, the new shop. And it's going out here. And uh, it's a long story how I ended up out here. But uh, I guess we got time to tell it. Had a couple trees laying there, had to come around. But uh, essentially, if you have seen me pop up before, um started out as elk knob chainsaws and did that on a while or for a while on a mountain in hinton and uh then when i moved the shop back up to linside i started the TikTok and became small engine life um did that for a little while the youtube kind of went on the back burner whenever i first came to linside it became red shed power saws and uh Never really took off too much, but I've said, since I'm gonna come up here, still going through the woods up here, since I'm gonna come up here and just start over, might as well do long form videos, one or two, you know, a week for YouTube, as well as the short form and stuff under five minutes for TikTok. So when I'm coming out through here, this was a path years ago, uh, cleared it out last year some for the four wheeler, but uh, you can see all this small stuff that had grown up in it, stuff about the size of that right through there and right now there is no access from the paved road which is just through these trees right down you can see a little bit of pavement through there but in the summer this grows up thick and i kind of like the seclusion of it but come out through here we're about to open up here and i probably would be a good spot to uh turn the camera around here and explain what's going on so here is where it comes up to the property line and right here is it opens up to the left the line goes down here and there's your road we'll get a shot from down there but it's basically a bank and this grade is kind of even through here and then it starts uphill but my plan is as this comes up through here some a lot of these trees are going to get removed and i'm starting to widen this area out here but we're going to go back into the bank we're going to dig back into the bank and that's going to be the basement for the new shop which will back it up here a little bit you can see those trees like up there we're going to do timber framing style anything that's close to it we cut and probably if it's straight enough we'll mill it into a long timber in place and there's also a sawmill back at the house but use the chainsaw on the stuff that we can and out this down through here i'm going to leave a small barrier off the road of woods but like where this tree is through here hopefully this will be like the driveway gravel you know paved or i don't know maybe eventually paved but that's drivable area for the probably entrance that's going to come in up off the road down there and then of course you have your basement and that'll be like your pull-in bay for the larger stuff atvs side by sides and stuff like that will be on the bottom and then on top of it timber frame built will be the saw shop studio oil shop whatever it ends up being but plan to have the road grade continue on around through here kind of like where the four-wheeler path followed naturally. And then as it comes up and turns here at the property line, kind of mellows out to come on around. You can have a little switch back in it and then have this up in here made out to be a parking area and it will be made or at least coming into the grade where the building on top of the basement or the bottom shop for the bigger stuff will be and then plan to maybe have a porch out over top around the front of it but up here 
be able to like pull up in here and if you have chainsaws and stuff but if you have a trailer be able to stay down there on the bottom one maybe an entrance and an exit both down there or at least have a good turnaround spot so back down here looking down the path that we came down we're right here at the line walk down here in the road and look back up and give you a look at this bank and see what this uh plot here looks like from the road so this is here on the right corner standing here on the right corner basically have a bank let me back it up to a half here you have a bank and you can see the kind of flat spot through here and it starts up into the hillside the other line is right down there by that large tree going up the hill it is a half an acre 150 feet up and it's 150 feet this way so the idea for the driveway will probably be somewhere along through here just go into the bank gradually and get up to where we're up here and then take the dozer and smooth that off. But the stuff into the bank up there, since it's not very easy to get equipment back in there right now, I plan to dig it by hand with a shovel and, or a mattock and a digging bar and shovel, of course, and wheelbarrow. But for now, I'll be taking the little Nissan in and out of this road to do work and bring stuff in and out that I've been working on clearing so we'll walk it the rest of the way out